Hello and welcome to this mod first look video. Today we're going to be looking at the Machine Barn by Yornpoff. This is a single shed pack. I believe it measures 26 by 18 meters, so it's a fair size. So let's jump in and have a look at it. Let's go. Yornpoff's Machine Barn is definitely a European style, but it'll be fine here on our Riverbends map. So it comes in as 51,500 and has a daily upkeep of thirty dollars pounds or euros it's a good size it's fully rotatable 360 degrees it's very much in the style of the Horman uh, barns if I just scroll back to the top sort of in, in this sort of style but much larger come down we're going to pop it here we're not going to pop it on the field there's only one of them and I'll get a better light if I pop it here as opposed to where I've been putting my sheds recently so we'll just stick that down. Let's jump in and have a look at it. For the sides and the back, we'll still have to get our torch out. So we've got a different, different kind of uh, wood beam and, than what we've had in uh, previous sheds that we've looked at recently. Got the uh, cement foundation and footings. Wood paneling looks nice though. Again. You know, similar to what we've seen in previous iterations in 19 and 22, but for 25, you know, textures are of a higher resolution. Things do look better. And um, we've got snow masks and everything's all in there. They look really nice. Looking really good. Good detail on this. Lovely beam work. Man is a fan of his beams. Look at the woodwork up there. That's, that is really nice. I do like that. I'm sure while we're playing, we don't really get in and appreciate it as much as we, we probably should. So that's why I like to showcase these barns, because they are absolutely beautiful. And this takes time. This is craftsmanship in Blender. This is, uh, yeah, really nice work. Nice support on that beam there as well. It looks absolutely beautiful. It's nice and flat, nice and smooth. Textures are nice. Footing's nice. Wood. Wood beams are nice, panelling's nice. Plenty big enough. I mean, we've got nice solid ground as well. Um, probably could uh, use your force tip, you can dump on that ground if you wish. But there, plenty of room to get your machines in there, get your harvesters in there, even some big harvesters in there. Some trucks, even. Plenty of bales. Plenty of room for stacking bales. You can get in there with a telehand or a wheel loader. Plenty of clearance. Like I say, very much European style. Get these on a, a nice big German, Austrian, or even a French map. They wouldn't go amiss on a British map, to be fair. A nice modern shed on a British map like that would be lovely. But like I say, you could pop these on any map you like. Work them into your gameplay. It's your gameplay. But these are really nice. Again, this is by Yornpoff. It's the Machine Barn. I really like it. Hopefully you guys do too. And uh, hopefully you've enjoyed this little uh, first look video for me. If you have, give a big fat thumbs up down below. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, turn the bell notification on, find out when new videos are going live. As always, comments and feedback down there. You guys have a wonderful day, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.